Time for your first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Scott Padgett. Uh, honey, you're not winning the lottery with this forecast, my friend. I mean, we missed yeah. you and all, but <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, not at all. But you know, whoever wins the lottery, they're my best friend, by the way. I'm not sure if you know that already, but but yeah, we're, we're like this, totally. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure where you are, but we're best friends. Uh, you know, we're not best friends with this forecast. Mother Nature and I, we're having a little bit of beef. We're talking about it. I wish I could cool it down, but you know what? Let's alert you to this weekend. Another time to stay inside of the air conditioning if you can. Maybe go to the movies if you can. Inside the mall, walk around. You need to win the lottery to buy some of that stuff. 103 tomorrow and Sunday, Monday, 104. Feeling hotter than that. So please keep that in mind. Feeling maybe like 104 to 105. So summer heat checklist, water bottle. Definitely make sure you are hydrating as much as possible. Have that sunscreen on. Reapply it. Baseball cap, make that shade if you can. Take breaks in the shade or inside of the air conditioning if at all possible. Now, Mother Nature's helped us out a little bit with some cloud cover for today in parts of North Texas. A little bit of rain in the northwest sides earlier this morning. Now, here's your forecast for your rain chances the next six days. Nothing. Yeah, that's it. Unfortunately, this dry pattern will continue. Now, the fire threat, now through next week, it's there. And dry fuels are there. We know this. Hot temperatures back into the forecast. Low humidity. So, what that means is, yes, we'll have some dry air in place. It's going to be hot. That feels like temperature not as bad, but still, it's something you need to pay attention to. We could use some rain. We need about 10 inches of rain to help us out for the year. That's not going to be happening for us anytime soon. Uh, we can really use a tropical system to move through. None really uh, developing for us. So we're now at 98 degrees on your finally Friday night. It's a bit breezy. Winds out of the southeast at 16, gusting up to 30. So that's helping us out just a touch. Uh, if those winds were out of the south, southwest, we'd be even hotter. We are hot in Mineral Wells at 101. We're 101 in Bridgeport, 100 Hillsboro across the Metroplex in the upper 90s. And so the next few hours, that's your forecast for tonight. Upper 90s to the mid 90s. You already saw that sneak peek of the rain forecast. Here's your sneak peek. Well, not really a sneak peek. Here is the actual seven day forecast. 103 to 104. We cool down towards the end of next week. We might have a front move through Friday to Saturday with that rain chances are back on Friday at 20%. And then maybe Saturday and Sunday, high temperatures only in the upper 90s.